Wow. Jay and today I'm here with another book haul because Value Village 50% off sale we obviously hit that up real quick so without further ado let us get started the first book I have I think sounds really really cool is this is how it ends by Jen Nadol and it follows these five friends who go to this party in the woods and a discovery makes them have visions one of the friends named Riley sees himself in bed with his dream girl the only thing is is that his dream girl is his best friend's girlfriend. Then one of the visions comes true and Riley's friend finds himself as one of the suspects for a gruesome murder. The other friends are determined to prove the police wrong and that's when Riley starts to think that maybe these visions aren't hallucinations after all and they may actually be true. But yeah, I think it sounds fun. I think it'll be a good time because like contemporary but also thriller here for it. The next book I have I'm super excited about because it was on my most anticipated releases when it first came out. It is Swear on This Life by Renee Carlino and I think that this sounds really good as well. It's about a girl who buys a best-selling author's novel and she's reading it and she quickly realizes that this is her story and then she realizes that the author must be her best friend Jace who she hasn't talked to in a very long time because they had a bit of a falling out and it's her reconnecting and being like what the heck boy you wrote our story not cool. I think it sounds really good. I'm really excited about it. I think it sounds like a good old time. The next book also very excited about because it was on my most anticipated releases as well and it is Under My Skin by Lisa Unger. It follows a woman named Poppy who is grieving her husband's death. One morning he went running at the park and was murdered so she goes off the bender and has a couple of days where she doesn't remember. She wakes up very confused in a very tight red dress that she doesn't recognize and so she goes to the police. About a year later she's moving on from her grief and getting on with her life again but then she starts having nightmares and she is having blackouts, she's not remembering things again and so she decides that she's gonna figure out what happened to her husband all those nights ago and what that red dress meant. And I also want to know what the heck the red dress is about. I'm so confused. Like, did she murder her husband? Maybe. I want to know. The next two books, super duper duper excited about because the movie is being filmed right now and I'm just so excited for it and I've never found these two books before. But it is P.S. I Still Love You and Always and Forever Laura Jean by Jenny Han. Like I said, second movie being filmed. Saw the first one, loved it so much. Also really loved the book. So we get in ourselves some John Ambrose. Am I right, ladies? We're right. I don't know if that's a good thing, but everyone seems to like him more than Peter. So the next two books are also part of a series. I have the first book up there, Partials, but it is Fragments and ruins. These are both by Dan Wells. Like I said, I had the first book, so I figured we might as well get the second and third book for 50% off. So here we are. Then the final two books are the two that I'm the most excited about because sequels to Graceling, which I was obsessed with in 2018, one of my favorite books, but it is Fire and Bitter Blue, both by Kristen Kishore. And like I said, Graceling. I don't think I need to say more. Alright guys, so that was my little haul for today. Let me know down below if you guys have read any of these and what you thought of them and I'll see you all in my next video. Goodbye!